Hello and welcome back to God's Basement. So we completed chapter one last time. This time we're going straight on to chapter two. So, so far this game is pretty damn interesting. So like, what do you think of the game then? It's interesting. I should have asked you that at the end of the last video. It's hard to figure out. It's hard to figure out. <laughs> <laughs> but it's good because it makes you think it's not the generic type of horror game. No, it's, it's quite unique. pretty unique in its own right. It's, it's, it's quite good. All right, this is the room we got into last time, didn't we? Yeah. So we got some info here. There we read. go. We got something to read. Dear mother, I know... Oh, hey. I know it's been a while since we last saw each other, but I just wanted to let you know that the delivery was successful. It's a perfectly healthy boy, and we've named him James. He's absolutely adorable, and I can't wait for you to meet him. Take care, your son, Neil Young. So, you've had a child? Yeah. Wait, you're not I'm glad you made it through in one piece. Whatever you saw might have jogged your memory a bit even though all of it occurred before you were born. Your parents, Neil and Sarah Young, had a son named Kevin. Your grandparents were looking after him when an unfortunate incident occurred. After losing their only son, your parents decided it would be best to create some distance between your grandmother. Although she tried her best to seek their forgiveness, the grief they felt was too painful. For a long time, they stayed out of contact with your grandmother. After a few years, they had you, James Young. They still were quite distant with your grandmother, possibly afraid the same incident might happen again. I don't want to bore you too much with those details. There is something I require from you. For you to unlock more of your memories, you need to go deeper into God's basement. To do that, you need to retrieve a security card to get past the door to your right. Fortunately, there is one down the hallway to your left. Just follow it all the way down, past the area with the red lights and it should be in a storage room filled with shelves. Once you retrieve it, bring it back and slide it across the panel next to the door. I know you still have your suspicions, but I swear all your questions will be answered. Once you have a complete understanding of your past life, I'll tell you what God's basement really is. But you have quite some ways to go. Keep doing exactly as I say. And one last thing. Good luck. Why would you need luck? Well, I mean, I don't think you need to tell us what God's basement is. Because I think Twinkie's already figured it out. It's... It's hell. Yeah, it's I like, think. Yeah, well, it could... It might not be, but... Yeah. To my, the best of my knowledge, it seems like a sort of hell. So we need to go through that door. This, and we need to go down this way. This this could be like the in between, the journey between um, here and heaven, so to speak. You know, or here and hell. It could be like the test that you go through to determine whether you are worthy to be in one or the other. You know. So this is the room with the red light, and there should be a storage room. Uh, something to read here. There's a lot to read. Last night I had a dream. I was walking towards my son and his family. They looked so happy together and I yearned to be part of it. As I kept walking, they kept shrinking, becoming more and more distant. Even as I increased my pace, the space between kept exponentially increasing until they disappeared. I haven't seen them since the accident. My son writes to me every now and then, but will never answer any of my calls. I haven't heard his voice in years. They recently had another child, an adorable baby boy. I desperately wish to see him. My son wrote to me saying that he couldn't wait for us to meet. I pray that he keeps his word, Margaret Young. So that's... Was that the grandmother? I I'm getting so confused with the names and who's who. Yeah, that's the corridor we need to go down. But before we go... You sure this isn't the storage room of shelves? No, this is the security room. Security room? Wait, is that someone... Ha <laughs> uh, ha! She's there. <laughs> There's a person there. Wait, in in a red lit area. Behind a shelf. Oh, she's in that room right over there. I know she is. I don't want to go there, but I have to. Oh, well, there's lights on the on the ceiling. Oh. On, on, no, you, you can't open the door until the lights. You have to push the lights most likely in a specific order. Yeah, yeah, you have to do it in an order. No. Do you have to just light them all? No, no I think like if it, if you do it in the right order. In the right order. Yeah. Whatever. So the there's six screens. So 
One, two. Yeah, I think it's that one, that one, and that one. No? Hmm. There must be something. Hmm. <laughs> um, there must be a hint, uh, like a six. The, that's Probably obviously a code. a code, and you're going to have to do it in the yeah. correct order. I um, thought it was the screen, six screens, or unless you got a... No, I have to see the lights go off when it's the wrong order, I think. Or there's going to be a hint somewhere telling you which ones to push. Hmm, right. Oh, well, it was worth a try. Um, you can always just see if the door is open anyway. That That's an option. Yeah. Just remember, she is through there. Oh, goody, you can't open it. That's fine. We're good with that. She's behind that shelf in there. Yeah, I know. So there is a code somewhere. Most likely. There were no other ways to go, were there? No. This is it. Unless we have to guess the combo. Guess, guess the combination. It might make you go all the way back again. Aaron, how long does it stay a light for? And time them. That one stays lit. That one doesn't go off. Okay. okay so that's the first one. No, okay, that goes off. Hang on, wait for it. No, that's not it either. Looks like we're, we're just going to guess the combination here. Okay, it. okay, it stayed lit. No, okay, so we got those two. Yeah. 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 Hey, Done whoa, it. there you go. It was all about guessing. <laughs> Just waiting for it to, like, not go off. So that means that you're now going to be able to go through that door. She's probably glitching into the wall. Does that mean that you're safe? No. Yeah, she's glitching to the wall. She can't get it you. It just means the door's open. Yuck. Right. Yuck indeed. She's right behind that. Oh, at least there's, that's where she was. She's not there anymore. This is the storage room with all the shelves. You've got to find that key card. That's the storage room. Yeah. It's this music I hear. Sounds like some sort of classical music. I remember you can squeeze your way through these shelves, some of them. Yeah. Like that, just, just in case something decides to start chasing you. Because there's a phone there that might ring at some point. Although this time around you weren't told to ignore any phones. There's a key card. Alright, what's gonna happen? Oh no, flashing lights. No. It said to keep going, didn't it? It did indeed. <gasps> yeah. Fuck. Just don't stop. Oh god. Keep going. I'm leaving my flashlight on permanently. <laughs> yeah. I don't see a point turning it off. Oh, I do love how you close every <laughs> door. <laughs> that was cringy, that was. Right, okay. Oh, I, do, I like that. Yep. So just go, just don't stop. I mean, you don't even like look to see us through the door before you walk through it. No. You just like instantly walk through. Right, anything here? No. No. It wasn't that shelf she was actually behind, was it? No, no, she was in a red room. There's oh, blood. there's blood. Ew. Oh, there's a teddy. Yeah. Uh, let's have a read of this first with the flashing light. That's fun. Dear mother, how have you been? It's been pretty hectic over here, balancing family and work. James is about half a year old now and he's growing healthily. I have some bad news. I might have to relocate to another state because of my job in the next few months. I don't know for sure yet, but there's a high probability that the of the relocation. 
I know I promised to let you see your grandson and I really intend to let you see him, but it's difficult to find the time. I'll keep you updated on everything, your son, Neil Young. This could be a hospital of some sort. Is it a hospital? This? I don't know. But that, that teddy right there. Yeah, I'm not touching anything yet until... Right, okay, let's do this. Can't touch the teddy. Zoom in on him. And there is a box right there. That's what I need to touch. Yeah, okay. In other news, a car crash resulted in the death of a grandfather and an infant child. Authorities reported that the car swerved off the road and crashed into a tree. The only survivor was the grandmother of the infant child. Although she suffered major injuries, uh, he's repeating everything that he's already said. What have you got to do? I don't like that light going off. Oh, okay. Yeah, she's in there. Okay. Do I acknowledge her? Uh. Is that your grandmother? If you look at her too much, she shakes. Yeah, she shakes. She starts to want to come after you, I think. Fuck. Right, okay. Teddy doesn't do anything. Are you panicking a bit there, A little you? bit. I mean, I think... I think it's safe because the door is locked. But is she closer? No, no, she's, she's still there. What happens if you just, like... What's the... Oh. <gasps> you realise that door's probably unlocked now, yeah? No. What is... Is that a baby crying or is it... Or is it a grandmother crying? Oh crap! The box moved! Oh! That is cool. That is f***ing weird. Is it like there's a baby in there or something? That's that door right there. Yep. Yeah. Where is she? Is she not there anymore? I don't know. She's gone. Ha. Huh. Ooh. Okay, well that wasn't okay. too bad. And that was actually a, a really short chapter. <laughs> yeah. I mean, that was freaking interesting though. That was definitely I like interesting. The puzzle. I th that was strange and weird. Right, okay, so we're going to leave you here. This would be the next chapter, wouldn't it? Yeah, chapter three. Chapter three. Uh, so that's what we'll do with every video. Every video will be a chapter. Yeah. So that guarantees, like, I don't know, 10, 12 videos. How many chapters were there? There's 11. There's 11, so 11 that's 11 chapters. videos. So we should have that done in 11. Unless we get so stuck on one, we've got to do one chapter twice. Yeah. So yeah, if you all enjoyed, please hit the like button, subscribe, and we'll see you in the next one. And again, well done to the dev. This game is brilliant. Bye-bye. Uh, Peace.